Kidney disease is a major risk factor for heart disease, both of which are amongst the top 10 causes of death for Canadians. Addressing kidney disease early is one way of having a positive impact on helping to reduce cardiovascular disease. Dr. Jean-Francois Kelly, a clinician, scientist and nephrologist, explains. Studies have showed that renal function is associated with cardiovascular diseases. If your kidneys are not working properly, you are at increased risk of cardiovascular diseases. The reason why is probably related to the fact that when the kidneys are not working properly, the level of waste is increasing and this might increase inflammation leading to cardiovascular diseases. You can easily measure the level of waste in the blood. You just need to have a blood sample to assess or not the proper function of your kidneys. Blood pressure is also a reflection of kidney function. Therefore, if your blood pressure is high, this might be the indication that your kidneys are not working properly. Francois René Dassault discovered firsthand what happens when the kidney you need to live shuts down. He received an organ donation from a deceased donor, but when the transplanted organ failed almost two years to the date after he received it, Francois René started home hemodialysis treatments to cleanse his blood in a way his kidneys could not. I did nocturnal hemodialysis at home for about five years. Uh, these treatments required eight hours per night, and I would do them five nights a week. It is at that time in 2004 that I decided to get involved with the Kidney Foundation of Canada, mostly with the peer support program where I would listen to other patients who had just learned their chronic kidney disease. I would talk to them about their choices with uh, dialysis treatments. I told them my experience with um, nocturnal hemodialysis, the fact that I had stopped my training at the beginning and that I had decided to go back knowing that it was one of the best treatments after a tr uh, kidney transplant. People should have their blood pressure checked. Furthermore, if you have diabetes, you're obese or you already have hypertension, it's really important that you have your kidney function assessed by either a blood sample or urine analysis. This way, the sooner we can detect the presence of kidney problems, the sooner we can treat it to prevent the bad consequences that kidney disease can have on you. In 2008, I received my second kidney transplant. This is a wonderful gift. It's the gift of life that allowed me to be healthy again. And organ donation in this regard is so important. Patients who suffer kidney failure like myself will benefit from an organ um, like I did. As well, research on kidney disease, research on dialysis, on transplantation is very important. And this research must continue. For kidney health tips, information on organ donation, or to learn how research can make a vital difference, visit the Kidney Foundation of Canada website at kidney.ca.